Hey, Justin here. I'm at Zuma Beach just hanging out with my wife as the sun's setting. And I wanted to uh, just take a moment here to talk to you about a topic that um, as, a, as a young entrepreneur it really hit home for me and it was really being scared of success. And um, it's something that took me a long time to really resolve and figure out for myself. And so I'm hoping that it's gonna help you transition through that challenge if you're facing it. And I do see a lot of business owners with this uh, particular issue. And what I mean by scared of success is that, um, you know, a lot of business owners that I help through my coaching program is that they are, you know, they're investing in coaching, they're taking programs, they're doing meditation, they're doing a lot of things to move in the right direction and to continue to improve uh, themselves as, as leaders and as business owners and um, as individuals as well in their own personal lives. But a lot of times what I find is that there's some psychological baggage left behind and you know all those early years of entrepreneurship where you're really hustling and putting in the 10 to 12 hour days and um, sometimes more than that, right, to get your business off the ground, to take your business from an idea to an actual uh, bringing into a, a business entity and bringing value to the marketplace for others. Um, there can be a lot of hustle, right? We know that. And I think what happens is that as we start to um, garner some success in our business and we have the, um, the passion to continue to grow our business, uh, sort of um, the little, you know, the little reminder in your subconscious mind is saying, hey, remember um, remember how hard it was to, to get to this point with all the hard work that you put in and all that grinding and extra hours and the things that you missed out on because you were you know, hustling and trying to build your business? And your subconscious is sort of reminding you that, hey, if you want more success, um, you're going to have to work harder and harder and remember how that felt it wasn't it didn't really feel that great it was really tough and it was difficult and it was challenging and it was stressful and it created frustration in our lives and and that's what creates this sort of being scared of success subconsciously is because uh, as much as we are consciously taking programs and getting coaching from professionals and and you know diving into specific areas of our business to improve those areas and strengthening our own personal skills we still haven't really resolved or let go of a lot of the subconscious beliefs that we have and it's really holding us back from you know being able to see new success in our business so you really need to go through and find a way to um, to let go of that energy and let go of that that old programming that may still exist in your subconscious and again meditation can be a great way to get through this and um, really knowing that the now moment is the only time there is there is no past there is no future there's only them the now moment and just because it might have been really difficult for you to um, to get where you're at right now with the success that you have you know you may have put in a lot of hours a little time a lot of time a lot of money um, maybe you didn't do some of the things you wish you could because you were investing so much in your business. That's not how it has to be for you to go to the next level of success in your business. You can do things a lot differently, right? You can start to create a flow state. You can um, find a balance and make sure that you are working on your personal life as well as your, your business life. You can um, create leverage by hiring folks and having people on your team, right? It's a different time. This is. This is not um, this is not the way it was before and just knowing that and going into the next stage of success for yourself and it will remove that sort of subconscious uh, feeling that you're scared of success I've seen this I've felt it myself I've gone through this process multiple times in over the years uh, with various businesses that I've been in and had to grow to specific levels over time is that I figured out subconsciously I, the reason I wasn't seeing the success that I was trying to manifest it wasn't because I wasn't um, doing the right things and taking the steps every day to improve myself and my business it was that I had a subconscious belief that um, having more success in my life would mean that I would uh, ha have more stress and more frustration and I would be 
away from my friends and family more simply because I was working harder instead of smarter in my business. And so I learned to dissolve that energy and dissolve those old beliefs so that I could move and manifest uh, the reality that I wanted in my business and in my personal life. And so hopefully this can help you if you feel like you are having some of that challenge and you're sort of battling and saying, well, why am I not seeing the success um, that I've been working so hard for? It may be that you have some subconscious uh, beliefs holding you back because the subconscious believes that um, more success will equal uh, more stress, more frustration, and more problems, more issues. And the sooner you can let go of that energy and that, that belief in your mind, the sooner you're gonna see the, uh, the reality that you desire manifest a lot faster. And so I hope that this has helped you in your process and I hope to talk to you soon. Take care.